Teenage girl mistakenly handcuffed and released up in North Myrtle Beach. It's a story we've been working to get to the bottom of for weeks now and one we're getting a new look at tonight. Our Ashley Bowles joins us in the control room to share that clip with us for the very first time and also break down the new implications it's creating. Tell us more, Ashley. Yeah, Eric, we got our hands today on new dash cam video from North Myrtle Beach Police revealing human and not tech error is likely to blame for a traffic stop that's landed the department now in civil trouble. Turning now, I'm trying to get up to it. This telling clip seems to disprove a license plate reader mix up is responsible for the now infamous May 3rd incident. Video shows officers trailing a North Myrtle Beach high schooler a full car behind with her license plate out of view until just seconds before they pull her over. Show me your hands. Show me your hands. Officers would end up detaining the driver, 18 year old Lanisha Hemingway, who they suspected of driving a stolen car. This, despite the fact that dispatch had issued a correction minutes before the traffic stop, clarifying police should be searching for a stolen Dodge Challenger and not a Charger. Hemingway hadn't been dodging police, but rather heading to senior day activities in the last few days before her high school graduation. She and her family have since filed a wrongful detention lawsuit, claiming the two officers involved in this traffic stop wrongfully detained her. It also took Officer Wallace a full 12 days to file a record of this incident. Now, North Myrtle Beach tells us they do not comment on pending, lit pending litigation, and the two officers do remain on active duty status tonight with the department. Reporting in the control room, Ashley Bowles, WMBF News.